Greetings gamers, I'm Eurogamers YouTube editor Ian Higton. Now, ever since the end of World War II, the display of Nazi symbols in Germany has been illegal. Now, obviously, in a game like Wolfenstein The New Order, where the main aim is to aim at and maim as many Nazis as possible, this could cause quite a problem for the development team, if they were planning on selling the game in Deutschland as well as the rest of the world. To solve this problem, the German version of the game had to undergo a little bit of sense. Censorship. In this video I'm going to be comparing the censored and uncensored versions of Wolfenstein to find out how machine games managed to play hide the Hitler with their assets and get their game released in the fatherland. For a start, take this box here. There are plenty dotted around the first few levels of the game, and in the uncensored version they display the image of an eagle atop a swastika, which is the former symbol of the Nazi party. Over in the censored German version, the offending asset has been replaced with the much less offensive Wolfenstein symbol. What can I do for you? We can't get to it from our position. In this uncensored cutscene, you can see a Panzerhund trotting along with a stylized version of the Iron Cross on its hind leg. Because this symbol was the emblem of the German Defence Force during World War II, it has also been replaced in the censored version, again with a Wolfenstein symbol, but this time in white. Back in the uncensored version, we can see a pretty blatant swash sticker worn on the left arm of this soon-to-be ex-Nazi. On his right arm, and also on his lapel, we can see the Sig rune, the twin bolt symbol that was adapted into the emblem of the SS. Both of these symbols are of course banned in Deutschland, so have been replaced in their version by the Wolfenstein symbol and a couple of other fictitious emblems. Displayed on the lapels are triangles, while the right arm patch holds what looks like a picture of a wolf's head with an R wing from Star Fox on top of it. New Star Fox game confirmed for Wii U? Probably not, it's probably something to do with Death's Head Special Regiment, but we can hope, right? It's not just Nazi related symbols that are a problem in Germany though. Any mention of the Nazis, the Nazi salute and its accompanying Heil Hitler chant are no-nos too. To combat this in the German version of the game, the Nazis are called the Regime and the game's dialogue has been changed appropriately. Have a listen first to the uncensored version. Sometimes Christmas, sometimes birthdays and sometimes Nazis come. They leave with patience and shackles. And now to the censored version. Manchmal ein Geburtstag. Manchmal lässt sich das Regime blicken. Für einen Patienten in Handschellen ab. As you can see in the subtitles, German BJ calls the Nazis Das Regime. Der Arzt ist jedes Mal außer sich und er schreibt dann aber doch. A bit later on in the game, as BJ and Bobby attempt to cross a Nazi checkpoint, a Heil Hitler is completely removed from the dialogue. Check it out. Uncensored first. Thank you. Hitler. And now the censored version. Thank you. Sie passieren. Fahren Sie. Vielen Dank. Du Dreckschwein. In the uncensored version, the Nazi soldier says, Thanks, now be on your way. Heil Hitler. In the censored version, it's Danke, Sie können passieren, fahren Sie, which is literally translated to Thank you, they can happen, drive. And then, instead of saying Heil Hitler as a reply, Bobby calls the officer a Drecksfein. English translation of that, Dirty Pig. How rude. While these minor cosmetic changes have had to happen to ensure the first ever official release of a Wolfenstein game in Germany, you'll all be happy to know that the core game and the brutal uber violence have been left untouched, so the whole world can enjoy the sight of Aryan heads exploding. Kablawi! Take my hand! Das Kablawi! Nehmen Sie meine Hand! 
Thanks for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel by clicking on that on screen annotation. We've got exclusive interviews, early gameplay previews, retro content, interactive live streams, and loads more video game goodness dropping daily right here, and you won't want to miss it. Auf Wiedersehen. Thank <laughs> you.